The election commission today issued the notification for the seventh and last phase of the Lok Sabha elections in which 59 constituencies spread across eight states and union territories will go for polls. While the first phase of election was held on April 11th, the last phase will be held on May 19th. So far, two phases have taken place, while the third phase of polling is on Tuesday. All arrangements are in place for tomorrow's polling for the third phase of Lok Sabha elections. 116 constituencies spread over 13 states and two union territories are going to polls in this phase. Voting will take place for all 26 constituencies in Gujarat, all 20 in Kerala, 14 each in Maharashtra and Karnataka, 10 in Uttar Pradesh, 7 in Chhattisgarh, 6 in Orisha, 5 each in Bihar and West Bengal, 4 in Assam, 2 in Goa, 1 each in Jammu and Kashmir, Dadra and Nagar Haveli, Daman and Diu and Tripura. The political fate of several prominent leaders of various parties will be decided in this phase. Seven suicide bombers who were involved in the series of eight devastating blasts that tore through churches and luxury hotels in Sri Lanka on Easter Sunday, killing 290 people and wounding 500 others in the worst terror attack in the country's history. Amadmi Party's South Delhi candidate Raghav Chadda today filed his nomination papers for the upcoming Lok Sabha elections. Chadda filed the nomination papers in the presence of Raj Sabha MP Narayan Das Gupta and party volunteers. He also organized a roadshow in South Delhi. Former Chief Minister and Congress candidate from Northeast Delhi, Sheila Dixit, while addressing a press conference said, Tie-up with the Aam Aadmi Party is no longer on the table. Meanwhile, Congress today announced the names of six candidates for Delhi Lok Sabha seats. Fielding former Delhi Chief Minister Sheila Dixit from North East Delhi, Ajay Makan from New Delhi and J.P. Agrawal from Chandni Chowk. The Congress also fielded Arvinder Singh Lovely from East Delhi, Rajesh Lilothya from North West Delhi and Mahabal Mishra from West Delhi. Samajwadi Party on Monday fielded ex-BJP MP Ram Charitra Nishad from Mirzapur Lok Sabha seat, replacing the existing candidate. Ram Charitra Nishad will be the party candidate from Mirzapur in the place of Rajinder S. Bind. Nishad, ex-BJP MP from Mashlishar constituency last week, joined the Samajwadi Party in presence of Party Chief Akhilesh Yadav. Google celebrated Earth Day with a series of animations on six unique inhabitants on the Earth. Prime Minister Narendra Modi, BJP President Amit Shah and Finance Minister Arun Jaitley will exercise their franchise in Gujarat during third phase of Lok Sabha polls tomorrow.